Hi, I'm Bonnie Browning with the American Quilter Society, and I'm here today with Jean Clark from Mount Horeb, Wisconsin, and she's the third place winner in our bed size hand quilted category. Congratulations, Jean. Thank you. Very well, much. tell us just a little bit about your beautiful quilt here. What techniques did you use? I do a needle turn applique, and my, uh, my uh, quilting, I would call. Uh, I like to say it's echo stippling. Okay, and it's hand quilted it's too, isn't it? It's all hand quilted and hand uh, appliqued. Okay, and how the, many hours did you spend on this quilt? Well, the uh, applique took me 14 months, uh, over 2,000 hours. Just the applique. And the quilting took me 15 months, and that was over 2,000 hours. Uh, you know, I think a lot of times people don't realize how yeah. much time we spend <laughs> to make a complete quilt like this especially by hand. Yeah. Okay, now you entered, have you entered before? Yes, I got, uh, I got into uh, AQS. Yes. I have gotten into Paducah five times. Wow. Many years ago, but lately I haven't been uh, in. And um, I was in the Des Moines show uh, in O. Oh, nine or so, I think it was. Okay. Well, I didn't tell us win a ribbon then. Okay. But uh, so I'm thrilled. Well, you today. know what? I know that a lot of those quilters out there just think that they can't win because they're, or they can't enter because their quilt won't win. Tell us what it was like the first time you entered a quilt in our contest. What did you have to do? Well, I'll just fill out the application. My girls do it all. <laughs> it takes quite a bit of <laughs> filling out. Uh, and then the pictures and that's hard too to try to get a good picture. Yes, you have to have a full size picture yes. of the quilt and a nice detail, don't yes, you? Yes, and close up. Mm -hmm. And um, with red, it wasn't quite so hard as some of my quilts. It's harder to show, uh, you know, in a picture. Yes. But this turned out a pretty good picture. Well, is there anything else you'd like to tell us about well, this quilt? What are you going to do with it? Well, I've got one other thing to tell you. Okay. Uh, I broke 237 needles. Oh my gosh. Either broke them or bent them because it's batik front and back. Oh. And uh, that's hard to get your needle through that, isn't and it? And it, it destroys them right and left. <laughs> <laughs> and also, I broke my arm in the middle of it all, so that slowed me down a little bit. So what are you going to do with this beautiful quilt? Uh, my uh, oldest daughter gets this one. She has four others. Okay, and right, so your, your daughter's got to choose a quilt? Uh -huh. okay. they, chose, they chose each time, each chose one, three daughters, and then no duplicates. They chose again, no duplicates. They did that four times. And they never once said, I want this one and had a disagreement about it. <laughs> Well, you have some very lucky daughters because we can see how beautiful your work is. <laughs> Thank you. Con congratulations again, Jean, and we hope we'll see another entry from you next year. I hope you do too. <laughs>